G56 would be cool to activate your rook, but you can't do that immediately because P plus 6, 7 is great and you won't be able to defend the square 5, 7 and stop rook promotion at the same time. This is great to slow him down and if he plays pawn drop 6, 7 for example, then you can play G5, 6. This is a possible line if he takes it and it's better for you because the promoted pawn is gone now. This looks kind of messy but if you think about what is a good way to annoy your opponent, it helps you find a solution like this. The knight can't go any further and sometimes it requires you to score a few tactical points bit by bit. This will be your next move to play p3-4 to target the knight. Rear pawn slows him down just like bottom pawn and pawn block. The only difference would be that it works out great against minor pieces too. That's all for this video. There are still many situations that I can't cover, but understanding the basic idea alone will help you big time. Thanks a lot.